Hello and welcome back. My name is Greg Martin. Today we're going to be talking about what I consider to be one of the world's most interesting and certainly most innovative global health organizations, the Medicines Patent Pool. If you haven't heard about them before, listen closely, you are going to love them. And toward the end of this video, I'm going to talk about the relevance of their work in the context of the COVID-19 pandemic. In particular, I'm going to talk about how the Medicines Patent Pool might be an important mechanism to get therapeutics to people that need them in low and middle income countries. Firstly, nearly 2 billion people alive today do not have access to essential medicines and basic health technologies. That's a quarter of the world's population. Next, every year, nearly 100 million people get driven into poverty because of unforeseen healthcare expenditures that they cannot afford. Now, we know that new medicines are developed regularly, and these medicines could have a significant impact on mortality and morbidity in low- and middle-income countries. And there's a few reasons for this. The new medicines might be more effective. They may have fewer side effects, or they might be easier to administer. And in some cases, these medicines could have an impact on millions of people and have a real contribution to saving lives across the world. The problem, of course, is one of access. Patents for new medicines last for 20 years. During that time, generics manufacturers have to get a license from the innovator or the patent holder in order to make and sell those medicines in low and middle income countries. And historically, it's often taken many years from the approval of a new drug to an affordable version being made available in low resource settings. Well, what do we do about all these problems? Let me introduce you to the Medicines Patent Pool. Now, how it works is the innovators go into a licensing agreement with the Medicines Patent Pool. The Medicines Patent Pool then go into sub-licensing agreements with generics manufacturers in low and middle income countries. And the Medicines Patent Pool works closely with these companies to make sure that these products are developed and registered in the countries where they're needed. And then, of course, what we've got is we've got competition amongst multiple manufacturers, and this causes the price of the drugs to go down and increases supply security in those countries. And of course, the Medicines Patent Pool works with multiple stakeholders, including governments, international agencies, civil society, patients' advocacy groups, to ensure the rapid uptake and utilization of those products in those countries. And by doing this, the Medicines Patent Pool has shortened the time that it takes to get essential drugs and products to people that need them in low and middle income countries. And so everybody wins. The Innovator Company has its product or drug manufactured and distributed in countries through a mechanism with a proven track record and where appropriate, they'd get a royalty payment too. The Generics Company gets to manufacture and sell drugs and products that are still under patent. And most importantly, patients get access to affordable medicines that save lives. Now the question is, has this model worked? And the answer is, absolutely it has. They have signed agreements with 10 patent holders. They have sub-licensing agreements with 22 generic manufacturers. 141 countries have benefited from these agreements. $1.6 billion have been saved through this mechanism over the last decade. And 15 billion doses of treatment have been supplied. So what has this got to do with COVID-19? Let's talk about that for a minute. Firstly, and importantly, the Medicines Patent Pool has been given a mandate to work in the area of COVID-19. And what this means is that therapeutics for COVID-19 might be made available faster and more affordable in places that might not have otherwise had access to them. There is a real risk that new medicines for COVID-19 will only be available in wealthy countries that can afford them. So it's critically important that new medicines and therapeutics be made available in low and middle income countries quickly and at affordable prices. And the medicines patent pool is in a good position to contribute towards getting the right medicines to the right people at the right price in the right time frame. Now, if you want to learn more about the medicines patent pool, I'm going to put a link in the description below this video. Click on that link, go to their webpage, read all about them. They're a really interesting, incredible organization. Feel free to leave your thoughts and questions in the comment section below. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching. Take care.